I think in The Shining, he's writing about alcoholism and addiction, and either from the point of view of the father, who's the alcoholic, or from the son, who's the victim of having an alcoholic parent. And then in, the, in Doctor Sleep, he's writing about recovery and uh, sobriety, and I, I, I found that to be fascinating. And I think, yes, Danny's demons are demons. <laughs> like he's, he's drinking so he doesn't see his real demons. He has this extraordinary situation where he suffered from his father violence, like his father, the father breaks his arm when he's a child, before they get to the Overlook Hotel. When his father's drunk, he grabs him by the arm and breaks it, and uh, is, is horrified by it to the point where he gets sober. And his dad, is, when they go to the Overlook Hotel, is not drinking. And I think it's one of the things that Kubrick um, let Stephen King down about is that Stephen King felt that there wasn't enough. His novel was about that, about an alcoholic uh, living in a place where he couldn't drink, and um, it felt like the film didn't reflect that enough. But then my character ends up becoming an alcoholic himself, and, like not being able to deal with life on life's terms. He just drinks it away. I'm running away from myself, I guess.